Hi guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Welcome back to AJF Workouts. I'm so excited to be back again. I know I didn't really go anywhere in terms of YouTube, but I pre-recorded a bunch of my workouts before vacation, which if you didn't see any of my vacation pictures, now it's like almost a month ago, but you can go check it out on my Instagram. Um, but yeah, I pre-recorded a bunch of workouts before that so that they could still post while I was away so that I wasn't like hectic crazy the week leading up, the week afterwards. So finally I'm back and I'm so excited. Today we're going to be doing a 15 minute dumbbell only leg workout. So this is going to be a HIIT workout. We're going to be using dumbbells. It's only going to be 15 minutes. So if you're short on time, you want to blast those legs. Legs are my absolutely favorite, favorite, favorite thing to train. I know I said I love training shoulders. I love training back. I love training biceps. I really just love all training but by far legs are my favorite so I'm so excited to get into this workout today before we do don't forget to subscribe to my channel and click the notification bell so you don't miss any of my workouts and please give this video a thumbs up once you love the workout if you watched my last one you know that it really makes a difference when you give that thumbs up so please do that all you need is dumbbells for today's workout so grab a pair and let's get into it Let's get right into it. Today we're going to be doing two different circuits with five exercises each and we're going to be doing each one twice through. So again, you're going to need a set of dumbbells. I have a couple different sizes here that I'm going to be using, but if you only have one set, that's totally okay. Use whatever weight you have. If the weight gets too heavy and your form breaks, then you can just drop the dumbbells and do the movement without them. Totally fine. I'm going to show you the first five exercises for circuit one and we're going to get started. All right, exercise one is going to be called good morning. So you're going to grab one dumbbell for this exercise. Throw the dumbbell behind your neck, elbows out, feet hip width apart, knees slightly bent, and you're going to push your butt back, squeeze, and come all the way up. So this one you're not thinking about bending forward, you're thinking about sliding your butt and hips backwards, keeping a flat back, squeeze your butt all the way up. We're going to take those nice, slow, and controlled. The second exercise we're doing here. Actually, the second and third exercise, because we're going to do it once on our left leg, once on our right leg, is going to be single leg deadlift to lunge. These are very challenging. These get your heart rate up. If you have to drop your dumbbell right away, don't even worry about it. The only thing I need you to worry about is making sure your form is good. So start on one leg. You're going to deadlift, keeping your back flat, knee slightly bent. Come up. You can tap your foot for that extra balance, and then you're going to go right into a lunge. Tap your foot for that balance. Back into the deadlift, tap, lunge. That's the first three exercises. Exercise number four is going to be glute bridges. So lay down on your back, place the dumbbell right on your hips, find a spot that's comfortable, press up through your heels, squeeze your glutes, come back down. And exercise number five is going to be another one that really gets our heart rate up. Again, we're only using one dumbbell. I'm going to drop down a size because this one's pretty challenging going to be drop lunges and you're going to do a dumbbell pass. So you're going to start with your feet together, you're going to drop down into the lunge, dumbbell goes underneath, back up, down into a lunge, pass the dumbbell, back up. So this one's going to involve a lot of coordination and it's really going to get your heart rate up. So take it slow, take it controlled. Focus on getting the movement down before you really speed it up and get your heart rate up. So those are all five exercises for circuit one. We're going to be doing each for 30 seconds with a 15 second rest in between. So I will shout out what's next. It's going to be fast paced. We're doing this twice through with no extended rest period. All right, make sure you grab your waters. Put it somewhere where you're not going to kick it over with all our jumping. We have 10 seconds and then we're going to get started. We're starting with good mornings. Grab one dumbbell. Throw it behind your back, elbows back, and go. Slow bend down, hips are sliding backwards, squeezing all the way up. You can eliminate the dumbbell. If this is your first time doing these, focus on your form. We're feeling this in our glutes here. When you're down here, squeeze right away, all the way up. If you take out the dumbbell, just put your hands behind your head. Good, and rest. 15 second rest. Keep the one dumbbell. This time we're doing single leg deadlift to lunge. Remember, take this slow. 
Make sure you keep your balance. Make sure you keep your form. You can eliminate the dumbbell on this one if you need to, too. We're gonna start on our right leg first. Ready? Go. So single leg deadlift. Tap your foot for balance. Back into the lunge. Balance. Good. Make sure you're breathing. Back stays flat when you go back into that lunge. Now if it's more comfortable, you can keep the dumbbell in the same arm as the leg you're on. I like to keep it opposite for balance. 15 second rest. And we're switching to the other leg this time. So if you did the same leg as me, you're going to the left. And go. Single leg deadlift, tap for balance, lunge, flat back. Whew. One of your legs is going to be much easier to balance on than the other. Whichever one's your dominant leg, it's going to be a little bit easier. Just take it slow. Good. Two. One, rest. All right, glute bridges is next. We're keeping the one dumbbell still. Up on your back, down on your back. Dumbbell on your hips, toes up. Make sure you're pushing through your heels. Go. Up and squeeze those glutes. Back down. Make sure you're breathing. This is the exercise that's gonna slow our heart rate back down. We're going to kick it up again. Hold it for a good second at the top and just squeeze. Good. Rest. 15 seconds. We've got our last exercise. Drop lunge with a dumbbell pass. Remember, take out the hop if you need to. Two, one, go. Remember, flat back when you pass that dumbbell. Don't round your shoulders. Breathe through this one. This one's going to get our heart rate really up there. Good. We have seven seconds left. Good, rest. Whew. 15 second rest, we're going right into good mornings. One dumbbell behind your head, elbows back. Feet hip width apart, knees a little bit bent, and go. Sliding your butt backwards, keeping a flat back. Take these nice and slow. And don't forget to breathe. Good. One more time through the circuit. We're halfway done with the workout. Three, two, one. Good. Rest. Whew. All right. Back into the single leg deadlift to lunge. You got nine seconds here. Whew. Heart rate's up now. Two, one. Go. Slight bend in the knee. Flat back. Find your balance. And lunge. And breathe. This one's going to really get our glute. The lunge is going to get our quad. The whole move is going to get our heart. Seven seconds. If you've been doing a lot of my workouts, you know, I catch that timer at seven seconds a lot. And stop. I don't know what it is. All right. 11 seconds. We're switching over to the other leg now. Breathe. Try to get your heart rate back under control. Three, two, one. Good. Slight bend in the knee. Flat back. Find your balance. Lunge. Don't forget to breathe. Good. 
Remember, drop that weight if it's too much. You can always use the edge of a couch to balance. And stop. All right, 15 seconds. Back down into glute bridges. Hop down. Dumbbell on your hips. Go. Push through the heels. Squeeze your glutes. Be excited. Almost done with circuit one. Good. To make this one a little bit more challenging, if you're by a couch, you can prop your feet up on the couch. And stop. All right, last exercise. Drop lunge with the dumbbell pass. This one's the one that gets our heart rate's really up there. 30 seconds, then you'll get a nice break to grab a drink of water. I'll show you what's next. Two, one, go. Flat back when you pass that dumbbell. And stop. Good. Grab a drink of your water. Take a breather. I'm going to show you what's next. We got one last circuit, five exercises, same format, and then we're done. All right, let's pick up the energy for round two. Five more exercises, twice more through, about seven and a half minutes, and we are done with this workout. Here's what's next. Grab a dumbbell. We're starting this circuit off really strong. We're starting with a high intensity exercise. So feel free to drop this dumbbell if you need to. We're gonna throw it on the ground. We're doing squat, jump, pick up. You're gonna squat down, pick up the dumbbell, jump, set it down. Switch, jump, set it down, okay? Now you can eliminate the dumbbell. If you do that, I want you to squat, hold it for a second, jump. Squat, hold it for a second, jump. The second and third exercise, again, is going to be a right foot, left foot situation. We're going to be doing low lunges. You're going to start in your lunge. You can hold a dumbbell. If it gets too challenging, drop the dumbbell. But I really want you to challenge yourselves here. So, you're going to be in a lunge. You're coming forward, staying low, back into a lunge. When you come back into that lunge, your chest comes up. You really sink down into that lunge. Come forward. Number four is gonna be squat pulses. Now here, you can hold one dumbbell or you can hold two. Depends on how much you're ready to challenge yourselves. I'm gonna grab two here. Your feet are gonna be wide. You're gonna turn your toes a little bit outward. We're gonna hit the glutes a little bit more. We're gonna be doing sumo squat pulses. So, if you're down, we're just pulsing. From the side, I want you to keep your back flat. Don't round it, don't be pulsing like this. Chest up, back flat. Good, and for the fifth exercise, we're gonna drop our dumbbells. We're really gonna challenge ourselves here. We're just gonna finish it out strong with some burpees. So I'm gonna give you free range to decide what kind of burpees you wanna do. You can include the hop, you can exclude the hop, you can throw in a push-up. Since we're doing legs, you can add a squat pulse to the burpee. Whatever you wanna do to finish out this circuit. Again, this one's completely up to you. You can just step out if you need to eliminate the jumps. You can step out. Step back up, whatever you need to do to modify it, push through it, challenge yourself. So get ready, grab that last sip of water, enjoy these last few seconds of breathing easy, and we're gonna start seven and a half minutes, we're gonna finish this workout. All right, get ready, you've got 10 seconds, we're starting with the squat jump pickups. Grab a dumbbell if you're gonna have a dumbbell. Set it down on the ground in front of you. Get ready, three, two, one, go. So squat down, pick it up, jump, switch arms. Good, again with this one, flat back. Don't round your shoulders, flat back. Chest up. Make sure you're grabbing that dumbbell. Good, we have six seconds. And stop. Whew. All right, 15 second rest, we're gonna do low lunges. If you think that last one burnt your legs, this one's gonna burn more. You're gonna hold the dumbbell up here. Get ready, get into that lunge. And go, stay low, back into the lunge. 
low, back into the lunge. I want you to keep the majority of weight in that front heel. Keep your chest up, don't round your shoulders. Good, this one's gonna burn you to challenge yourself to stay low. Whew. You got three seconds, and we're coming off this leg. And stop. Whew. All right, we're switching legs here. Time to burn the other one. This last circuit, we're kicking up the energy, like I said. We don't have as many chill exercises. Go, down, chest up and back. Keeping that weight in that front heel. Don't come up. If you're really burning, just drop that dumbbell. Stay low. Challenge yourself here, it's only 30 seconds and we only have eight more. Let's work out short. So we have to push ourselves for these 15 minutes. And stop. Whew. All right, squat pulses. Grab zero, one, or two dumbbells. A hair flying everywhere. Two, one, down, pulse. Chest up. Back flat, stay pulsing. Drop the dumbbells if you need to. Don't stop pulsing. And breathe. Bring your heart rate down with that breath. You got five seconds, push through, push through. Two, one, Woo. All right, make room for the burpees. Remember, however you wanna do them, challenge yourself, push yourself. 30 seconds here, three, two, one, go. Good. Try to get five to six in, go. Got 10 more seconds. Get two more. All right, and stop. All right, we only have 15 seconds here. Grab a dumbbell, one dumbbell. We're doing squat jump pickups. We're back at the beginning. Not a lot of rest here. Three, two, one, go. Jump up, switch. Eliminate the hop or the dumbbell, if you need to modify, but challenge yourself, push yourself. Good, 10 seconds left. Three, two, one, ooh. All right, breathe it out, low lunges. We only have four, exercise le four exercises left. Two minutes of work, then we're done. Then you got it in, you got your movement in today. Go, stay low. Breathe through it. How good will it feel to have gotten your 15 minutes of really good movement in today? It'll feel good enough to push through this workout. Let me tell you. And stop. All right. Enjoy these 15 seconds. We're switching legs. Get your breathing under control. And go. Push through the burn. Drop the dumbbell if you need to. Stay low, keep your weight in that front heel. Keep your chest up, sink back into that lunge. And breathe. 10 more seconds here, that's it. And we only have two exercises left. We're done with the whole workout. Three, two, one. All right, squat pulses are next. 
Zero, one, or two dumbbells. How hard are you pushing yourself today? And go. As long as you're keeping form, I want you to push yourself as hard as you can. Part of challenging yourself is knowing what that challenge is and what's pushing yourself too far. Don't break form. 10 more seconds here. Push through it, I know it burns. Trust me, I know it burns. Three, two, one. All right, 15 seconds, we have 30 seconds left of this workout. Burpees, whatever kind of burpees you wanna do, let's get it done. Got five seconds, push through these last 30, come on. You got it. Go. Whew, almost forgot to jump. Good, halfway through it. 15 seconds left. Whatever kind of burpee you're doing, keep it going. Push it. Three seconds. Two, one. Whew. All right, guys, if you've made it as far as you hear me rambling on at the end, I'm proud of you. Good job, be proud of yourself. You got it in, you chose to put on this YouTube video today. Get that movement in, and that is enough. Thank you for doing this workout with me today. I really appreciate everybody who's coming to my channel, doing my workouts with me, sharing my workouts with your friends. At this point, We've been doing this for four months. Feel free to go check out any of my other workouts. I also post new ones weekly, so stick around. Thumbs up this video if it kicked your ass. And come back for another workout next week. I will see you in a week. Bye.